Oh, come on. How much health does he have? I've been critting non-stop. That's right. Get knocked the fuck out, baby. Still alive, huh? That was a mega reptodon. We got him. Well, 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 guess who's back? The one and only, the master of them all. Hope you guys are ready. Um, Jesus Christ, I hope you guys are doing fucking well. We're gonna continue. As you guys might have noticed, I have been busy so far. I took a little break just to catch my uh, breath for my voice. And uh, we did a fuck ton of side missions. <laughs> did we get much extra from it? Not really, besides the fact that we're about level 21 right now. Uh, uh, 20, I mean. And we just leveled up a bunch of skills. Currently, we're gonna level up hacking, because we need it for, uh, another side mission. Uh, but right now, we're gonna go, go ahead and continue with the main story mission. We were just about to turn in Radio Free Monarch. So let's go ahead and talk to this yeah. guy. And it's end the it. the blessed sound of radio silence, which leads me to believe you have sweet, sweet news for me. Oh, you bet your sweet ass I do. MSI and the Iconicus are no longer transmitting. Is the data ready? Yes, indeed. I am back in business. Good. But before we get down to it, might I ask how you handled the problem? In the end? Well... You don't want to know the details. Blood everywhere, bodies all over the place. Ugliest job we ever done. I bet. Hey, is that so? Doesn't matter. I helped both MSI and Iconoclast to get what they wanted. I don't know how. The two are diametrically opposed and impossible to please. But no. it matters not I did it anyway. Problem. Only that you did. Right. I don't doubt that you are working with Phineas, but my contract specifies I relate any acquired information to the purchaser and to the purchaser alone. Good. However, to send the data, I will need your assistance in cycling the antenna's receiver so I can input the needed adjustments. Fine. Uh, and I bet I have a whole new checklist of crap to do before it works, right? Phineas doesn't trust many people. How do you up with you? Oh, don't be ridiculous. We're resetting a broadcast tower, not filing taxes. Well, I don't there know. No errands, spreadsheets, or rituals involved. People always ask me to do it's extra shit, true. so don't get so I pushy. I really need you to waltz outside and throw the lever to cycle the power. I'll key in the numerical adjustments from in here. All right. Sounds good. Got it. Except I need three keys before it'll activate. And I have to go find them, right? Eternal no. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Who would ever design something like that? I don't know. However, just step oh, outside, crap. flip the switch, depart forever. Understood? Good. Marvelous. We're in agreement. All right, yeah, dweeb. Yeah, oh, I keep pressing spacebar. Don't burst a blood vessel. I'll give it some consideration. Got it. Terrific. I'll be here. Waiting with bated breath. Give a shout if the panel electrocutes you. Listen here, you piece of fu Never mind. <laughs> not hitting. Not hitting. He's not worth it. Okay. Don't need anything from that. All right, let's head out to Devil's Peak and go ahead and activate the radio Taumion. You feel me? So, yeah, we're going to continue with the main story line and see uh, what we can do to finish this shit up. Testing one, two. Check, check. There you go. Stars. But that is a beautiful sound. Can you hear me? We are a go for broadcast. Awesome. Oh, and I also dispatched Phineas his data. Impatient prick. Worse, I'm now indebted to him for it. <laughs> I'll kindly thank you to get out of my tower. Alright, so be it. Happily, I won't bother you again. Don't make me come back in there. There's no need to assert your dominance. I doubt I can make you do anything you don't wish to. <laughs> Look, I am well aware that at times I may have the tiniest iota of a prickly exterior. But I must admit, I have grown rather fond of you. <laughs> Jesus. Take care out there. Thanks, buddy. Boss, you seen this? Wait, what? Oh! Wait, is that my ship? No, right? Better not be. That better not be fucking my ship. Well, looks like I'm gonna go ahead and have to explore. Did you see that? Whose ship was that? The big ball of fire? No, totally missed it. Look, there's not enough room in this tower for two sarcastic hullheads. So one of us has to knock it off. <laughs> All 
All right. Right. I reckon we both know who that'll fall to. Oh well, a pity for the crew, but I can't see how it affects me. Hiram, can you hear me? Sanjar Nandi. Did you see that? Architect saved me from swindlers and fools. Sanjar, what are you bloody doing on my channel? <laughs> did MSI or did MSI not cease broadcasting? Yes, but Hiram, Hiram, are you there? Somebody explain what's going on? I should really just have killed all of you. Allow me to save you the trouble <laughs> as I fling myself from the tower. Ah, the good captain. The truth brings us together once more. Our salvation Jesus has Christ, these guys are nuts. We need only yeah, what can you expect? Weapons. Are you mad? That's a UDL gunship. You'd probably shoot your own toes off. Surely we can talk this over. Ah, I see you learned nothing while dealing with these buffoons. We could use the gunship's armaments to defend Stellar Bay, but we need its targeting module. Guess who has to retrieve Our that? Is so close to breaking free of this planet and spreading to the stars. Help us secure that module, and we will save our colony. Listen, I don't care a single whit what you do, so long as you leave me out of it. Which means, get off my void damn channel. I'm more than finished with you lot. All right, so uh, we jump started the tower. Looks like we got about 500 miles to start walking from the Cascadia landing pot, so let's go ahead and fucking do that. Alright guys, thank you so much for all the support we've been having today, and um... Yeah, this has just been spam recording for me, and it's been uh, pretty fucking fun to do. I've uh, absolutely been going non-stop so far, with just a little break in between of doing uh, some stuff for my own, and enjoying the game myself a little bit. Um... Not saying that I don't enjoy it when I record, of course, but, you know, sometimes it's fine not to talk <laughs> when you're playing a game and just enjoy it. But beside that, I have two mana queens? Fucking hell. Why am I always a fucking screwed up one? Oh, my God! Ripple that fucking piece of shit. Hunt. Die. How is she alive? Alright, we got one down. There we go, we knocked him down. That's another 200 hit. Woo! Man! Man to swarms. Looks like I'm not really losing any health here. That's good. I'll take that. Everyone's fine. Got the headset. I keep wearing it. It's starting to itch my head. I don't know if you guys have a problem too, but I cannot wear hats, for example. <laughs> the itches, man. Scratches! Oh, I thought I jumped over it. Die. It's a die. There's so many. Another manticore, huh? Boom! How many of these goddamn mantis queens are here? Jesus Christ, I'm gonna have to heal up. These guys are insane. Got him. They should kill her. Got him. Got him. We killed the mana queen. Die, you piece of shit! Oh, double dodge. Double dodge! I, know, I hope you guys are ready to fucking spam watch all these episodes. It's been a blast recording so many in a row. I usually don't have time to do that. I'm really glad I told everybody to piss off and leave me alone today. <laughs> so yeah, that was nice. But uh, beside that, I'm really grateful for all the support we've been getting so far. And guys, again, in a few days, we'll be uh, we'll be doing Star Wars. And I will be giving away two copies of the game. People who watch every episode, I apologize for telling you every single episode. But it's for the new guys. You can Oh, come on. How much health does he have? I've been critting non-stop. That's right. Get knocked the fuck out, buddy. 
still alive, huh? Oh, he's a mega reptodon. We got him. We had a weapon mod and everything. Ooh, that gets you staggered. That gets you staggered. All right, so if you want to have a chance to submit to that, uh, we're doing again 50 comments. So everybody who is uh, signing up for that giveaway, you're welcome to. Uh, at 50 comments, I'll be giving away the game. And I probably am expecting not that to be super soon. But we got some time. We got some time. I'll be, uh, I would really appreciate it if you guys would share it on, uh, on whatever I share it. So that could be, um, Twitter, Instagram, stuff like that. I'll also be sharing it in my Discord if you guys aren't, haven't joined that yet. I would highly recommend it. Uh, to be up to date with all the notifications I'll be giving you. Um, beside that, of course, I will also be, uh, sharing it with you guys as many times as I can. If you want to get instant notifications, make sure to turn on notifications on YouTube on. And I think we're good so far. And we're killing everybody. As you guys might have noticed, I upgraded the mace. It's fucking incredible now. I put Mr. Ouch on it. If you guys don't know what that is, well, uh, <laughs> neither do I. It doesn't matter, though. It doesn't matter. I just gotta figure out how the hell we're gonna get up there. I don't think we can parkour. What if we walk around? That should do it. Oh, that's a... That's a marauder. Let's try this. Got him. How many more? Hurts. That hurts. Alright, lots of fucking editing and photoshopping to do in a little bit. <laughs> it's gonna be spam uploading episode after episode the entire weekend long. And uh, I think I've recorded until episode 19 already. Jesus. It's been going fast. You go on ahead. I'll just wait out here. Yep. We'll be keeping watch here. Why? Are you not coming? You're my team. Uh, okay, okay, Hello. My name is Jen. it's the Mayday message. Jesus Christ. Well, Nothing like a good hard middle finger. Let's go in. I hope somebody's okay. I hope the chief engineer is okay. That person is awesome. Uh, what do we got? Retrieve the gunship's targeting module. It's very convenient, huh, to get this. Give the module to Sandra or give it to Graham? Um, I thought Graham was pretty fucking nuts. So I was gonna, I'm, I'm just gonna go ahead and give it to Sanjar. Uh, I think Sanjar was in the Stellar Bay? No. Was he? I can't remember. Yeah, yeah, he was in Stellar Bay because those nut jobs were in their own private, in their own private city. So let's go ahead and give him to this dweeb, and I uh, <laughs> hope he'll be happy about it. I certainly am not. Man, this game has been a fuck ton of fun. I don't know how much you guys have been enjoying it so far. I hope you guys are excited about the, the spam uploads that are coming right now. Uh, thank you so much. The Wouldn't be able to do it without you guys. There won't be any chance for a peaceful monarch. I don't suppose you've found the targeting module yet. I have. I've sent patrols, but... They're running into trouble with the Iconoclasts. Uh, could you agree a truce with the Iconoclasts? According to the ship's log, they suffered some kind of malfunction. 
That's surprising. Let's get some money out of this. Usually in top shape. After all, they have first access to any fresh parts or components. Perhaps there's something deeper going on. A conspiracy? You've spent too much time around Graham. Uh, why do you need the targeting module? Because the module controls the weapon systems. I mean, why do you need a gunship's weapon system? Once we mount them on Stellar Bay's walls, no Marauder or Raptodon will ever be a threat to us again. Gotta hand it to you, Sanjar. That ain't a bad plan. It's absolutely foolproof. I suppose. Stellar Bay will be as secure as any other settlement in Halcyon. If you say so, that's a worthy goal. You don't ask me to lug a bunch of cannons from that ship, too. I don't see how UDL is going to let you keep their toys. The boards on salvage and recovery clause 32B would say differently. And they won't right. dare challenge us over this. Not after the data you found on their experiments here. I suppose that's true. Uh, it seems like the people should be able to handle this. What's so bad about the Iconoclast reaching the gunship? Can you imagine what those maniacs would do with weapons like that? True. They'd wreak havoc. You said that like it's a problem. The board would consider us complicit in any of their folly. That would only get us ousted again. And roll back all the progress we've made at reconciling with the rest of Halcyon. I suppose that's true. Good point. Even if they merely sat on the scraps, the threat of a bunch of anarchists holding a gunship would bring the full wrath of the board down on Monarch. We can't afford that. True. Alright, you don't just... log a bunch of cannons from the ship too. Don't worry. We'll send an engineering team for those later. We'll have to disconnect them from the rest of the ship. Of course, they'll be useless without that targeting module, which is why it's critical that you retrieve it. Well... Give him the tar these weapons sound pretty powerful. Says the guy sent me to go get it. Which is also why we can't let the iconoclast get them. Um, seems like your people should be able to handle this. Look, Celia, he's being funny again. I don't think so, sir. Really? Well, I could have sworn. What well, that's not important. What is important <laughs> is that there's a considerable nice recovery, Sanjar. And most of it is inhabited by Marauders and Raptodons. Enough about the gunship. Yeah, that's pretty treacherous. What's the matter? Can't get your hands dirty now and then? I want to get money out of this. Do you just think of these things in the moment? Or do you write them down and save them for later? Hmm? They're very good. Just answer the question. Oh, I can play along. Jesus Christ. What I've got here is a town full of yellow-bellied corporate castoffs who wouldn't know a stun baton from a slide rule. <sighs> How is that? Not ah, pretty good, I'll take it. Pretty good, actually, yeah. Wow. Thanks, I... Uh... <clears throat> Thank you. Yeah, you should. All right, um... Enough about the gunships. Good, because we haven't a moment to lose. Right. <clears throat> Uh, could you agree to a truce with the Iconoclast? They're all mad. And what's more, they left us. I don't see any way for us to work together. Forget I said anything. Nonsense. I value original thought. That. Oh, okay. So I guess I'm not getting any money out of this. Excellent. At last, we have what we need. I wouldn't get excited just yet, sir. It looks like the Iconoclasts followed you. I have word they're gathering in the ruins outside of town. All right. What now? If they want to fight, we'll give them one. Ooh, I just got goosebumps. You really know how to sell that, don't you? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Maybe you could, uh, the, you this me. game, man. What the hell? I doubt this is the time. Right. I'll lock the south gate to keep them out. You'll have to approach from the north. Good luck. All right, let's make it happen. Our first war. I'm fucking excited and so is my mace. Let's go ahead and mod some stuff, especially our armor, because it doesn't look like we are... Um... This is not the exit. This is the exit. Okay, any workbenches around, maybe? There's one. Let's see what we can give them. Nothing. It's going to be my main wep, for sure. This one, how about that, huh? Ooh! Install mod, yes. <clears throat> this one, I don't have one yet, so... 
dodge distance, carrying capacity, height, light range. Falling by my footsteps might be a pretty cool one. So this one right now is a fully. I never knew him. I was. A... That's awesome. But I'm kind of curious though, because if I, um, let's say I would unequip her armor, or change it with this one. Call orphans who grow up in the back. So that would be that one then. No, just these, huh? I guess that one couldn't be modded, maybe. I'm so confused. What am I wearing then? Okay, I don't understand, but I'll take it. All right, decent. Let's do this. Let's get ready for war, baby. And I think we're gonna be doing that in episode 20. That sounds like a perfect episode to start a war with. Hope you guys are ready. Thank you guys so much for watching and for the incredible support we've been having so far. Um, episode 20 will probably be recorded maybe later and maybe tomorrow. We'll see how it goes. Probably tomorrow or Monday. Uh, simply because I just got a lot of editing to do right now. So thank you guys so much for watching for the incredible support. You guys are the best audience I've ever had. So far, at least. <laughs> red, red. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Yeah.